Just papa, just make the lead, just you're not it. Jihan, you understand? They are going to the beach by bike. Cheers! Cheers, Yanati! So today is a beautiful sunny day and we are running biking to Lake Michigan. <laughs> that was Yonati. Today we have a new member in our ride club. Our running and biking club. So you see behind us is Nick Deli. We are running, biking to Lake Michigan and to the right of me we have little Yonati. Well, Yonati is for the first time cycling to Lake Michigan. She won't do it all the way. She's too small yet, but she wanted to come with us with Nick Deli and Daddy. She wanted to see how far she can ride. All right, see you guys later. It will be a 30 mile, 21 kilometer ride. And well, we'll see how far Yonati will get. When she says she doesn't want any more, we'll stop. And mommy's going to pick her up. Mikkeli and Yonati fits on that strand with Papa, Papa Rendernast. It's a half future, but now has my mama in the auto. Hello, Mousy. Hello. Hello, Fergly. Now they're echt klaar. Mousy, Fergly, and Papa. Papa gaat verder rennen en we gaan lekker met de auto, zodat we heel veel strengplezier nog hebben. Hallo Mausi. Hallo. Was het leuk? Ja. Leuk met Veugli voor het eerst. Hallo Veugli. Wauw. Jonathie is 5 kilometer gefietst. Wauw Jonathie, 5. 5,5 kilometer. Woehoe. Hi, good night everyone. The kids are finally in bed. And uh, we can bet late today because we're on the beach. We are here actually to tell you about how excited they were to go to the beach because they didn't go by car, they went by bike and they really loved it. But today was a special day. Um, Unity turned three yesterday. And um, as you know, when we go to the beach, uh, usually uh, Mick Daly and I either uh, bike or, or run. I would run and, and she would bike or I would bike and, and she would bike. So Unity has always been kind of envying mm -hmm. her, her bigger sister because she needs to go with the car. Unity has to go with the car, with and, mommy. But Migdali can go with daddy on the bike. So yesterday it was a clear matter. She's three. She has to go with the bike. She has to go with the bike to the, to the beach. Well, it is 22 kilometers, so she cannot make all the way on it. So it was clear. I had to pick her up somewhere in between but she would start on her own bike. It's a half marathon distance, 21, 22 uh, kilometers and then 13 miles. And so I was kind of suspicious whether she's going to make it for like more than mm -hmm. two kilometers or so. So she was biking, I was running and <clears throat> after two kilometers, mm -hmm. I, I, I realized this, this girl is not yet done. So uh, she asked me, where's mommy? And I said, well, mommy is going to come a little later and she's going to pick you up with the car because you're not able to make it all, all the way to the beach. Oh yes, she, mm -hmm. she would be able to, to make it all the way she to, said, to no, the beach. Mommy's not no, coming. mommy's not going to, to pick me up. She's going alone, she said. so. Well, of course, what happened is then uh, Karen came along about after two and a half kilometers mm -hmm. or so with the intention to pick up to pick up Unity. Um, but but Unity rejected, she, she refused. Uh, she wanted to go with the bike uh, to, to the beach. So then Karen and I had a short talk and then she would further drive down the road uh, at kilometer mark six, that, and that's about four and a half miles. Mm -hmm. and, and so then uh, Unity cycled uh, all the way uh, up to six kilometers, four, four and a half miles, um, and then Karen would pick her, pick her up. And she didn't look tired at all when she came. She was just fresh as she would have started from home. Right. So um, what was interesting, when we were done in the, at the beach, it was like 
kind of getting late. Uh, I was getting ready for biking back and Unity really had this attention. What, what did she say to you? She told me, where's daddy? I told him, her, he's preparing the bike to go home. And she's like, where's my bike? I told her, you cannot go by bike because you have to go by car with me. It's getting late. No, I can go by bike. But I told her, daddy's going to be fast on his bike. Yeah, but I can be fast on my own bike too, she said. Our message basically is, what we realize is that a couple of, of mm -hmm. families are, are struggling to get their kids active. Mm -hmm. Either biking, running or, or just sports, you know, They're playing with soccer, playing outside, climbing up trees. or Being um, excited of doing things outside. Exactly. So, so we're wondering why did our kids never complain about getting outside and, and I think the reason uh, for that is because they always see mommy and daddy active. Mm -hmm. I run three times a week in the morning with a group of friends and I try to do it early in the morning before the day is starting so for them it's clear mom is going for a run or she's coming back from a run and normally I have to take Unity with me when the amygdala is, uh, is at school so for them it's kind of daily life and uh, and of course they're looking up to the parents always mm -hmm. uh, and so if you want to be as big and great as daddy or as big and great mm -hmm. as, as mommy uh, you, of course, you, you, you bike and things. run and you do the same, same thing. So, so Migdali, the older one, uh, she's now turning six in, in a month or two. Um, she, yeah, for her it was always clear, you know, running and biking is part of life. Mm -hmm. so. And all of her commutes she work every day, he's running or biking every single day. For them it's just clear, he's not never taking the car. Yeah, so that for the kids it's clear if, if somebody needs to go to work, if daddy needs to go to work, it's just normal. Mm -hmm. you know, he, he has to run or he, he's biking. So now there are interesting dynamics taking place between Yonati, the three-year-old, and Migdali, the six-year-old, mm -hmm. because Migdali can bike already and she bikes with daddy and, and these kind of things. So now Yonati automatically wants to be like her sister. Sure. So again, there is no motivation that has to take place um, between parents and Yonati uh, because the fact that the older sister is so active mm -hmm makes the honesty automatically active as well. So to sum it up, if you want to get your kids active, you know, you have to start with, with yourself. Yep. Um, get, get yourself active and, and show the kids that it's part of the normal routine of life. So if it's mm -hmm. part of the normal routine of life, everything else falls in place. Yeah. I mean, if you are having a hard time yourself to go outside and do fun stuff outside and be active outside, they will pick up the message. So they won't be enthusiastic to go outside. Mm -hmm. If you start doing yourself, and you start being yourself enthusiastic about it, they want to just copy you. If you have difficulties with getting enthusiastic about it, mm -hmm. we suggest get some friends, get a yeah, community yeah, that is active, that, that is celebrating that, that active uh, lifestyle. And, and so the kids automatically see that it's a normal part, fun part of, of life. In fact, Social what, what, life, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's part of social life, yeah. actually. Uh, in fact, now with, with, with your running uh, group, mm -hmm. um, there are more and more kids coming uh, because the mummies are, are running and, and they have to take the kids along. Exactly, mm -hmm. and the kids are coming along, they all come with, with their bike. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's really a social event yeah. um, and it's fun. And then you have the accountability there, you know, when you have friends, they are waiting for you, so it's easier to go and it's yeah. fun to go. Right, right. All right, good. Well, I hope you guys will have as good a sleep as, as we're going to mm -hmm. have uh, and we, we just want to encourage you to pursue that active life. It increases the quality of, uh, of life and uh, it will help your kids without you needing to force them into anything exactly. to automatically pick it up and, yeah. uh, and enjoy that life, live fully as well. Yeah, just offer them a healthy life in a fun way. Yeah. Alright, bye! bye.